Video number eight, YouTube editor. Something awesome about YouTube is the ability you have to create videos inside of your account. To go straight to the YouTube editor, go to www.youtube.com slash editor. Here, you'll see listed all the videos you have uploaded to YouTube over time, as well as several editing tools you'll learn how to use right now. The first thing you must do is name your project. I will just name it testing video. Then, you'll be able to drag one or several videos from your list of previously uploaded videos right here to the timeline. The video editor will be displayed automatically. Here you'll be able to do all sorts of things like quick fixes, filters, add text, and edit the audio as well. Under the Quick Fixes tab, you are able to edit the brightness and contrast, change the speed of the video, rotate the video, pan and zoom, or stabilize the video. Under the Filters tab, you'll be able to change the look of the video. This is a really awesome feature that can impress your viewers, depending on what kind of video you are trying to create. You can also enable the text feature to insert text in your video. You'll be able to pick a font of your choice, as well as add some of the most basic text effects, such as bold and italic. Of course, you have the option of changing the size, color, and alignment of the text. You can also decide the position of the text, as well as edit the background area of the text with the banner options. Finally, in this area, you can put your text. Here you can preview effects side by side with the original video. You can then close the video editor, and we'll take a closer look at this function here. Right below this option, you'll be able to search for Creative Common Videos and add them to your video project. Under this option, you can add pictures to your project. You just need to click on the Add Photos to Project button, and then you'll be able to add them from your photos, from your albums, or upload them from your computer. Right here, you can do something really awesome to YouTube videos, and that is add audio to it. This is useful if your video doesn't have background music already. The audio editor has volume, pan, bass, and treble sound editing options. You can then close the audio editor and add some really awesome transition effects to the timeline. That function is useful for multiple videos or when photos are inserted in the timeline. Here, you can also add a title to the timeline. With this little tool right here, you can expand the video for easy viewing and for working on the video. This is really useful to synchronize all videos and photos perfectly. And there you have the video with the effects already inserted on it. Once you are done playing around with the video editor, click on Create Video. And you just need to wait for it to be live.